Hi everyone, welcome to Food Friday, and it's my series where I talk about the best foods for eye health from A to Z. Now, in case you missed any of the previous episodes, go back, check out my posts, and you can catch all those great foods there. Today, we're up to the letter I, which was a little bit tricky. There aren't that many foods that start with the letter I. I was thinking I would talk about ice cream. It's one of my personal favorites, but maybe not so healthy. So I had to find another eye food and the one I chose was this, which is iceberg lettuce. Yes, so you may be thinking, well, lettuce, isn't it just water? What other nutrients does it have? Well, you're actually right. It is really mainly water. So iceberg lettuce um, has about 96% water. Uh, it also has some fiber. It has some other nutrients, but really not that many. Not as many compared to some of the other lettuces like romaine lettuce or other um, leafy vegetables and kale. But the key is iceberg lettuce contains water. And uh, I talked about water today, uh, this week in my series, Envision Health on Tuesday, where I interviewed Dr. Dana Cohen, who's a functional medicine expert, and also she's written a book called Quench, all about hydration. So we're talking a lot about the different ways you can get water. And traditionally, we've all been told, have eight glasses of water a day. You need to have that eight glasses to stay hydrated. Well, that's not necessarily true because you can get your hydration other ways. You don't necessarily have to drink your water. You can eat your water. So you can get your water from plants, from fruits and vegetables that have high water content, which is just as good as drinking water. That's key. Just as good and perhaps even better. So if you if you missed that Envision Health, it's on my IGTV, but also on Wednesday, I shared a post of the top 16 fruits and vegetables that have the highest water content. And so you can check that out and take a look. And again, if you have a lot of those fruits and vegetables in your diet, you don't necessarily need to drink those eight glasses of water a day. So let's get back to iceberg lettuce and why it's so good for health and especially our eye health. Well, we need good hydration to get blood and oxygen to our tissues to also detoxify, to help us regulate body temperature, to help with so many physiologic processes. But what pe many people don't realize is that there are four phases of water. Now, many of us are, are familiar with three of them. We know water as liquid water, as vapor, and also as solid ice. But there is a fourth phase of water that was recently discovered. This is mind boggling to think that this is a new discovery. This was made in 2017. This discovery of the fourth phase of water, was, which is a gel phase. And this is also called structured water. And this gel phase is somewhere between the liquid and the solid phase where water molecules form, they stick very well together. They are very well bonded together and uh, it's actually a more pure molecule because uh, the water molecules stick very closely together. It's higher in hydrogen content. And the other interesting thing about gel water is that as opposed to regular water, which has a neutral charge, gel water has a negative charge. So it actually conducts electricity well. And it helps when we have gel water in our systems, it actually helps to uh, helps cellular communication. It helps other electrical processes within cells. Um, so, uh, so that's the interesting thing about gel water. So me most plants have gel water. And the way you know this is, for example, if you take a cactus and you cut it open, the water is not just going to drip out. It actually will ooze out. And that's true for many other plants, vegetables, and fruits. If you cut them, there's no water that just comes oozing, just dripping out. It oozes slowly. So it's a more cohesive form. And iceberg lettuce is a great structured gel water. Again, thought to be beneficial. This research has not yet shown it because this is again such a new discovery but consider uh, instead of just hydrating with regular water consider plants for that gel water so i hope you found today's episode of best foods for eye health interesting again it's not just for eye health that i'm talking about you know gel water and, and plants and, and iceberg lettuce but uh it's for overall health as well so I just want to show you here so i made myself a salad today for lunch so this has lettuce tomatoes uh, red onions, and I have um, some avocado in here, so healthy fats also. I can sprinkle a little bit of balsamic vinegar on top to add a little bit of flavor. And, oh, there we go. It's not coming out. Oh, this is almost like a gel itself. Look at that. So um, I hope you have a great day, and I will see you next week. Bye.